Hey guys, so this is here bringing you another video and a welcome to the second video that we're doing on Yumi. This time we're using her... Wait, 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 come back. Uh, we're using the uh, skin, which you can't really tell that she's got a skin on, really. Um, but yeah, we're using a skin, which is the Battle Academy. Uh, we're also changing up because, again, we're learning more about the champion. Um, we've got Ignite and Exhaust. We're not running Flash because it really was pointless to have it last game. And the skill order from the start of the game will max Q. Because, again, we went a few points in W last game early, which was kind of pointless. So, yeah, hopefully I'll have a good time. Ugh, hopefully I'll have a good time. Uh, we have had some issues people connecting to the PBE. So, it's taken a while for us to get this game going. Uh, but hopefully we'll be okay. But, yeah. All right. Let's see. So, yeah, this skin. Let's just have a quick look. Uh, again, it's it's hard to me to kind of say that this is a skin. <laughs> you can't really tell, in all honesty. Um, but sure. Like, yeah, her tail is different, and the book is different, and the cue's different. Uh. <laughs> I can't really help more than that. <laughs> Woo! Alright, so we've got a vein. I did ask the person that I was with AD carrying, by the way. Can they play something more hyper carry? Uh, uh, but will full disclosure, uh, Madman did tell me. And again, it's worth knowing because, again, PB testing is PB testing. Uh, Madman is bronze. So, uh, you know, it's, it's not going to be the perfect test, obviously. Uh, toe jump. Ah, oh, thanks so much, dude. So we are getting poked out quite a bit. Again, last game I did say that I want to auto-attack the enemy team more. So we're going to make an attempt to do that this game. Can I auto? You can't auto. Oh, positioning. That was not good positioning. Yeah. Uh, this is going to be a bit rough. <laughs> but that's also a good demonstration of Yumi. There's not much you can do when you've got, like... Uh, not a great AD carry, I guess. But that's fine. Again, it's part of the testing. Can I do anything when, you know, your AD carry isn't the most reliable? I also remember you start at level 1 with W, and then you can take Q. So at level 2, I have all three of my abilities apart from ult. Worth knowing. I shouldn't have taken that, but I just wanted... She still had, like, flash up and everything. So I just wanted to make sure. Uh, you shouldn't be clearing that. No, 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 no. We need Vayne to get farm. <laughs> just last hit. Because now, unfortunately, this is pushing. That wasn't very good. Damn. Oh, well. Again, this is... PB testing isn't the greatest. Her auto attack is actually quite nice. Alright, so... Let's try and do some poke. Get that auto attacks in. Get a Q. So remember, when you're attached to somebody, you become completely... Like, you can't get targeted. Why Dim Materializer? Uh, most supports are taking it anyway. And Yumi's got absolutely abysmal wave clear. So at least it will give you some form of wave clear. <laughs> I do like the mouse key when you're attached. I like that quite a bit. Alright, so uh, Aatrox got a kill in top. That's nice. Oh my god. Again, there's no AoE with the Q, by the way. So you need to be dead accurate. Otherwise, you're going to miss. Uh-oh. Uh, that's nothing I can do. Damn, my exhaust went off. Oh, well, rip. Damn. 
May as well stay. Because there's a lot of farm. And we get that auto attack in every now and then for getting mana back and uh, a shield. It's actually pretty nice. Oh, I don't have my... On, on the PB, I don't have my wards. Uh, not wards. I don't have my uh, key binds. So again, when you're not attached, you can't aim your Q. It's just a straight line missile. Alright. Again, don't need boots. Kind of pointless. Take me to lane, my steed. <laughs> uh. So yeah, we'll see how we can do in this game. Because again, it's been a little bit rough so far. Oh god, pathing. A hey, nice. But I think so far is a good example of like again, Madman. He's a regular in the stream. Obviously, there's no flame at the guy, like at all. But I think this is a great example of like what I was saying in the first gameplay that I did. Yumi is going to be very dependent on like your AD carry being good. You know, uh, you're trusting them. You know, they're doing what you, you know you need them to do. Damn, we needed to get there quicker. Um, so when you're with an AD carry that isn't quite up to stuff, and again, that just, that could be in diamond, that could be in your whatever rating, um, I think it's going to show a lot more on this champion than most. What the hell is, look at my, look at my character. I'm just sliding. Slide to the left. Uh. Slide to the right. Uh. Oh no. Oh no. There's like nothing I can do in this situation. <laughs> so yeah, this is a good example of like, I guess the negative. If you're having a bad time, Yumi can't carry. You know, she's an enabler. She's an enchanter. She ain't gonna carry at all. You know, Sona or Nami will have a better time carrying than Yumi. Which is saying something, yeah. So you can't get the passive... Uh, okay, so yeah, when... You can't get the passive if you're attached. You have to detach to get the passive. Okay, interesting. Damn it. Eee. Oh no. Well. <laughs> I don't know what I can do. <laughs> we'll keep trying. Uh, but we're just getting a bit stomped here. Uh. Actually, that could be an idea. Swap the AD carry and maybe me and Aatrox can murder them in bot lane. That actually could be a good idea. <sighs> More detaching. Yeah, I still don't think we're going to be able to do much though with detaching. Again, I'm not detaching sometimes because I'll just get murdered if I do. But, yeah. Let's do the swap. Okay, nice. That'll push in soon, too. Because, yeah, maybe me and Aatrox in an all-in can do more. <gasps> oh, hiccup. <laughs> this character legit sings about fish. 
Brilliant. So what is Yumi is like race wise? Is she the, she's not the same as Zaya and Rakan, no? I have no idea. Is she a new race? I'm actually not. Hey, let's go, dude! Let's go! It worked! Oh. I got the root! Oh, look at the damage. Oh, dude! We're OP! <laughs> she's a, I don't think she's a Yordle. That wouldn't make sense. Well, there we go. That worked. That was a good swap. That's that good stuff right there. Hell yeah. Okay, that was good. Okay, she attaching to a, a big bruiser also is pretty nice. Because, like, she can't die when she gets, like, when she's attached. And a Aatrox can't die. Sweet. Again, I do take tower aggro. You have to remember that. I do take tower aggro. I just let that go. Slow him. Hell yeah, we lived! Well, they really want to pick on the vein, sadly. Damn. Oh god. Oh, that's dead. Uh oh, I'm coming. We saved one of the towers. Tele oh yeah, I could have teleported with him, but I kind of wanted to go bot lane just to try and save bot lane. Uh, but yeah, she can teleport with people, and she can base with people. Um, she can do all that, which is kind of cool. I don't know if I like or dislike that she says we've got the zoomies. <laughs> I think dislike. Oh, that needs to be AoE. It would feel so much better if it was AoE. Because Jesus, you've got to be accurate to make it work. Again, combined with Hecarim is pretty legit because I give him movement speed. Ooh! He died! <laughs> he got one shot! Uh... <laughs> hey, I hit it. Oh, why are you tanking? Oh my god, everyone I'm helping just gets blown up instantly. Um, help. She's her race is spirit. That would make sense. Yeah, she ain't a yordle. There's no way. I don't think boots are useful. Not really. Ninety percent of the game, you're going to be attached to people. Ah. Oh. Yeah, her E's called Zoomies. Oh. 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 <laughs> I'm coming. Ah. I dumb. Jesus, I'm so squishy. I like detached to reattach. I got bubbled and got one shot. Wait, I didn't mean to buy that. I didn't get an assist. What? How? What? Okay. <laughs> kind of surprised I didn't get an assist, but sure. Woo wee. Um, 
She seems squishier than Soda. Yeah, she is. She's probably the squishiest champion in League. But again, most of the time you're attached to other people and you're untargetable. So that's why. Eh. Oh. Hey, nice. Hey. I wonder, like, I steal XP from people, right? I guess. Uh, it's like legit. I've got like a a, a, a pet. Ooh. I'm coming. Oh. Go, my steed. I got the slow. I'm not in range to the Aatrox. Yeah, let's go! I'm tr- Oh, I don't want to be out with someone! Oh, I don't want to be out! I slowed him! No, we didn't kill the Aatrox or the Na Nasus. We let him live. Oh, no. Uh, Chronic Gaming, or not, not Rick, nor Nick Gaming. Thanks, dude. Yeah, real, I say the one thing, thing I'm having to get used to is the fact that it's hard to, like, tell my own range. I keep, like, trying to use abilities when I legit just don't have the range for them yet. Because a lot of the time you're judging your own range just by knowing, like, what you can do. And obviously it's, it should be relatively the same, but I, it's hard to explain, but it feels different. It definitely feels different. Because, like, when I was there... Oh, what? Oh. Um, when I was here and I was using my ult, it was like, oh, I should be in range to, like, swap to Aatrox, but I wasn't. So, yeah. Oh, a little desk. <laughs> she just knocked a mug off the desk. Amazing. I uh, White Mist, thanks so much, dude. But yeah, like, again, if you are somebody that, like, likes to think of win rates as a way of indicating, here's the weird thing. I think she's not going to be a weak champion, but I think she's going to have one of the worst win rates in League of Legends history. Like, legitimately, I think it's going to be really bad. Damn. That missed. Up to Aatrox. Get that Q damage. And again, 230. Uh, it's not good, but it's not terrible. I just wish it was AoE. <laughs> Can we not fight this? I'm on Aatrox, baby! Wait, I got a kill. Dude, I'm a god! I'm helping! I need mana. Ugh. <laughs> Get me close! I am! I'm not... I didn't have the range. Oh, no. I didn't have the range to swap. Damn. <laughs> oh, no. I'm taking Tower Agro. Again, you can take Tower Agro even if you're attached. You have to be careful for that. Oh. Oh. Oh my god, I got one shot. I couldn't attach. <laughs> uh, D 
uh, Sir D Mox. Thanks so much, dude. Uh, they're not hard. They're not heat seeking. You control them. So when you're attached to somebody, your mouse movements controls your Q. So if Violet and you attach, what happens? I'm guessing it breaks it, but it might not. I don't know. I'm gonna get Arden. I know people have said like, oh, some people say it's not very good. I, it seems good. I don't know why it would be bad. Look, I'm attached to him. And I'm with him. Uh-oh. Ooh. Oh. Oh, I shouldn't have detached. I, I like to detach because I can get my Ardent back. But holy moly, me and Aatrox is a team and a half. If, like, my mistake for detaching there, if I didn't detach, we would have killed all... Like, we, well, we kind of did kill all of them. But, yeah. Like, legitimately, I wouldn't have died, and I think we would have, like, absolutely cleaned up, so... My bad, but that does show a pretty good strength. Again, she might be stronger with a bruiser than an AD carry. Huh. Oh, snap. Like, legitimately, she might be stronger with a bruiser. Oh. Hmm. Hey, got him. Let's go, dude. I just got to keep attaching to Arcanine. What about Kale late game? Oh, yeah, that would be dangerous. Uh, That would be very good. Her attached to a Kale. Yeah, that'd be kind of legit. But yeah, like, th this is why people are saying that they're a bit scared that she's just going to be a funnel strategy champ. Because it is all about just jumping on someone and helping them do better. So. But yeah. So she might bring out more funnel strategies like t with Twitch and Master Yi and all that type of thing. What? Right, attached to my boy. Attached to my boy Aatrox. Oh, ran out of room. Where am I? Oh, I'm in there. Again, it's really hard to keep track of yourself because you're not paying attention to your own movement. Because obviously that's... Oh, I hit him. I hit her. Okay. Give him a heat. Uh-oh. Right, I'm still on him. I'm healing him. I'm healing him. Let's kill the let's kill the Nasus. Let's go, dude. Get that slow on the Nami. Hey, let's go, dude. Oh, I tried. To, I tried to keep him alive. I couldn't. I could. There's only so much that I could have done there. I think I did as much as I could though. Uh. Ooh. We're starting to learn, like, you just need to, like, play her with someone that can hyper carry. And, like, yeah, you just enable them not to die. He definitely would have died if I wasn't on him then. Like, definitely. Am I having fun? Kinda, but it's a different type of fun. It's not your normal, like, oh, I'm carrying type of fun. It's a different type of fun. I never want a base. I'm just attaching to other people's bases. <laughs> I'm like, I'll come back. I'll come with you. Oh. Oh, oh man. Oh, this might be too much, my boy.
Let's go. I'm helping him. Again, it doesn't look like I'm doing anything, but I am. <laughs> That's the thing. She is definitely going to be one of these background carries. It's like, you know, what what does she do? I actually quite a lot, but it just doesn't look like you're doing anything. I'm li I'm just keeping him alive, which is kind of funny. I, the only thing that I need to keep doing more is detach to get my auto attacks in or attacks in in general. But man, it's risky when you're like detaching because you're just so squishy. There it is. There it is. Oh, there it is. Oh, see that? Massive, massive AOE like roots. I four roots. Boom! We got the root. Get that in. Get that slow in. I took tower aggro! Because <laughs> I ignited and I was hitting spells on tower. I was tanking the tower, not the Aatrox. <laughs> but I got executed because they didn't do any damage to me. <laughs> oh man, that's crazy, this champion. Okay. Again, I, I somewhat like it. I somewhat like it. Wow. Whoa. Like, that is, yeah, that, for, again, funnel strategies when you're tanking the tower as a Yumi and the only thing is hitting you is a tower because the enemy team can't hit you. Like, how are you going to stop that? Like, in a 2v1 tower dive? Like, that's really hard to deal with. Basically impossible. Oh, Knight's Vow actually might be good on Yumi because, again, you're not taking any damage uh, vast majority of the time. So if you're taking Knight's Vow, you're taking damage for your partner. And because you're not taking damage from other sources, like, it should be okay. Yeah. Okay. That's... Oh, no, my partner. I want to... Can we go this way? Take me this way. We could have gone that way. Ah! Ah! Someone kill it! No one did damage on my team. <laughs> that Aatrox survived for so long and I don't understand how. Uh, that was awkward. Yeah, that, that was awkward. <laughs> oh no. Now, Aatrox can't be that far away though. He's got a group with us. Because like, if he falls, the rest of my team is quite weak. And, like, I can enable him to stay alive. Wait, Baron killed Zed. Oh, they can't do it. Uh, I can help him stay alive, so I need to help. Like, I need to be with him. He, he, I, I don't want him to be teleporting away from me. Eh. Again, stop. Okay, I'm on him. Woo! You're mine. Honestly, we could maybe do Baron, you know? Can we not do it? Oops. Okay, it's hard to ward because, like, you're not in control of your own movement. Oh, I hit that randomly. I'm helping you. I'm just trying to keep him alive. We're in trouble here. Oh, 
Okay, I'm on him. Okay. Oh my god, we did it. Alright, back off, back off, back off. Oh, we did it! Mm. I can nearly keep you alive. I keep getting kills. I sp speed him up. Hit the Q! Hey! Let's go, dude! <laughs> Oh man, me and Aatrox can just wreck them! Let's keep him alive now. Look at my healing! It's actually pretty good now. Boom. Yeah, to be fair, my root did quite a lot of work in that fight. I want to do auto attacks because we need to kill it. Let's jump on him and heal him. Jump off and do auto attack damage and a bit of Q damage. Okay. Get that healing in. Alright, who's going back? Good. <laughs> Alright, um... God, what do I... I'm gonna go Knight's Vow, because like what I spoke about earlier, I think it just could... Wait, well, how much cooldown reduction do I have? Oh, I'm capped. Uh, I don't really want it now. What happens if I glory and I'm attached to somebody? I don't know. I'll just get. We'll just get this. But again, there there is testing. You need a big mana pool. Well, that's where her passive comes in. I I haven't really utilized her passive this game because again, I'm just so scared to detach. Because I'll just get one shot. I've literally got fifteen hundred health. That's it. It's not much. Zeke's would be better. Yeah, but this game I'm not really focusing on my AD carry. Again, you've got to adjust to the game you're in. And this game's not an AD carry game. Oh, that was really close. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Uh, yeah, I'd give him Zeke's. Go, 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 go. I hit that. Oh, I'm tanking the tower again. I gotta remember about that. Use the Mikhail's on him. Speed him up, boy. Land the Q. Let's go, dude. Heal him up. You are Sam. No, don't get bubbled. Ugh. Ugh. Oh, I missed. Hell yeah, dude. Uh. Yeah, yeah. Let's get rid of that. Get rid of Edge of Night. Oh, I'm tanking. I'm ta I'm dead. I'm dead. How would you keep track of your own health bar? That's so hard because you're not see. Uh. It's so hard. You need go you guys need to back out. They'll die with me. Not there. Um, it's so hard to keep health like track of your own health bar. Because, like, you're not seeing your own health 99% of the- Oh! Boom! Boom! Let's go. So this game, in a weird way, we've kind of done a funnel strategy to an Aatrox. I have literally just done everything to help this guy. Like, obviously, it needs a good Aatrox. It needs a good player to actually know what they're doing. But I've attached to him, like, whenever I can. And, you know, I think this is a great example uh, of this, this has been a rough game. Like the early game, and again, I love Madman. He's a, he's a big person in our community, but obviously he hasn't had a very good game. But as a Yumi, I've just gone right today. Like this one isn't. I can't focus on helping my vein. It's not the win condition. I'm putting everything in to help this guy. He's got 30 kills. Like 
I think that's a good lesson that you can just to attach to a different person and focus them instead. Which is good. That shows that she isn't completely reliant on just an AD carry. She can attach to other things and help them too. Oops. Well, I don't know what happened then. No, no, don't say sorry, bad man, dude. Again, we're just, this is testing. This, this, honestly, this has been a really good test episode, in my opinion. I still, yeah, like, I still don't think she needs boots. Look at how many support items I have, by the way. It's insane. Because I don't have boots, I'm getting one more support item than normal supports. Like, that's why I need... Uh, eh, come back, please. Uh, that's why in a weird way I can keep him alive as well as I am because I've got so many items so it's pretty legit we need to go top do I know because it's the minimap icon uh oh you give him ears I think I just give whoever I'm on like cat ears that's really hard to see <clears throat> oh, why are we stopping? Oh, wait. So he has 433 and now 457. Again, I'm not really buying AD, um, AP, so I'm not really giving that much stats. So that part of the kit has surprised me that that isn't the focus of the kit. But I am gaining, I am gaining 62 ability power by being inside him, by the way. That isn't bad. Hit him. Bam! I hit a minion. God damn it. Okay, we just gotta be patient with the minions. Wham! <laughs> Do you like that little Do you like that little spin? Style points. I'm actually poking quite well here. Alright, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. I'm getting bored. Oh, I detached! Oh, no! I detached! I don't know if that's good or bad! I kill you! I keep you alive! I keep you alive. I need to swap to other people. Get me that way. I attach to you. I want to attack you. <laughs> I got a kill at the end. Okay, yeah, this, this has been a great episode. Dude, what the hell? So again, really rough early. If you made it to the end... I don't know, in your comment down below, if you made it to the end, in your comment, put cats. Something in your comment. If you say cats in your comment, I'll know you made it to the end. But I honestly think that this episode has highlighted that how strong Yumi can be. But she is reliant. She is absolutely reliant on other people. Like, 100% reliant on other people. So if, the, if Arcanine on Aatrox didn't have a great game and he didn't trust me to keep him alive... I think we would have lost. But because we trusted him and because we en that en enabled, muy bien. Uh, we went 7 7 26, and then damage done at the end. Coming second in damage. Again, it, it was good for testing. And again, like we said, in PBE, there's different levels and stuff like that. So you never can take it as what it is. But this is a perfect, perfect example of what Yumi can do. You're funneling your strength as a your champion. You're basically helping one champion. And this game, we chose to help the Aatrox, and damn, it worked. But wow, I'm uh, kind of impressed. So again, if you made it to the end, smash the like button. In your comment, put cats. And uh, I'll see you guys next time. And that, that might be it for testing, unless these videos do incredible as well. Because, um, you know, I don't know. If this video randomly gets, I don't know, 
2,000 likes, which it probably won't. We'll do a mid lane episode, but we'll do a more funnel esque mid lane episode. We'll get somebody playing something like a Master Yi jungle, and we'll do the same thing, but have Yumi in mid. Uh, but that's going to be it. Like, subscribe. See you guys next time. Peace.